Now, NBC5 First Warning Weather. Brian, it sounds like the sun is going to make an appearance today, and it should be a nice day. Yeah, it should be a nice day to uh, get out and do something with it uh, yes. here in the uh, the middle of summer. Last day of July looks pretty good, and we're off to a great start this morning as well. Sunshine's up. A couple of clouds around. Uh, I've noticed they've been hanging around the tops of the mountains, and you can see that here. Uh, top of Camel's Hump. Got a little cloud over it. Same thing, Mount Mansfield. Noticed Jay a little while ago as well. So not a bad start. Some fog in the valleys too. Been dealing with that. 65 right now in Plattsburgh with a calm wind. Looks great though. So we look out over Taylor Park and uh, downtown St. Albans this morning. Uh, looking pretty good in St. Albans. 61 right now with a south wind at about 6 miles per hour. Northern New York temperatures in the low 50s in Saranac Lake at 57 right now, but 63 in Messina. And low to mid 50s in uh, eastern parts of Vermont, 54 in St. Johnsbury, 59 in Montpelier, and 58 in Lebanon. It is 65 right now in Burlington and Middlebury. Storm tracker pretty quiet this morning. Not a lot going on here. We mentioned a couple of clouds kind of hanging around in spots around the tops of the mountains, but looks good from Saranac Lake, Potsdam, back towards Malone. Northern Vermont looks good from Morrisville, back towards St. Johnsbury, Montpelier, Randolph. And to the south, more of the same, and mainly clear sky this morning. And that's the uh, that's the story across the northeast, although you'll notice some extra clouds back towards the south and west. And those will, will begin to move in here a little bit as we get into later on this afternoon. So sunshine this morning, mixing with some extra clouds later on today, but not bad mid to upper 70s and the higher terrain this afternoon to low to mid 80s for highs as we get into the Champlain Valley. Two points today, not that bad. Uh, it'll be a comfortable day. We'll start to see that humidity on the increase, though, as we head through later today and into the day, especially tomorrow and Tuesday. Tomorrow's going to be a pretty warm, hot, humid day with highs up near 90. You can notice here with future dew point tomorrow evening at 730. Yeah, things starting to feel a little bit more oppressive. Cold front moves through on Tuesday, though, and you can kind of see that here as it moves in from the north and west. So we'll get back in on drier air by the time we get to late Tuesday and Wednesday right now. Looking pretty good. So here is future cast. Quiet this morning. Not a lot going on. Sunshine mixing with some extra clouds. We'll start to move in by lunchtime. You'll notice some, but especially by later on this afternoon. And not a, a, you know, a big deal. Uh, there'll be clouds around, but it turns out to be a pretty nice day. Partly cloudy overnight tonight. Tomorrow looks good too with sunshine as you get up. Hot and humid tomorrow, the high up near 90 on Monday before that front moves through and cools things down a little bit on Tuesday. Some of those showers moving through Monday night into the day on Tuesday. And I think during Tuesday, still the chance for some showers around with some clouds too before we clear out again for Wednesday. So enjoy today. It looks pretty good. Sunshine mixing with clouds through this afternoon. 78 this afternoon in Saranac Lake, but up to 86 in Burlington. So yeah, cooler across the mountains, but a little bit warmer as you get close to Lake Champlain. Tomorrow, 90 for the first day of August. How about that? A lot of sunshine around tomorrow. Looks pretty good, but hot and humid. Then that front moves through, brings in some storms for Tuesday with our high up near 80. 88 on Wednesday as the sunshine returns. Another front moves through on Thursday. That one Thursday may be a little bit more feisty. Uh, we'll watch that for you by later on in the week. High Thursday up near 90 again. Then we begin to cool out, uh, cool off rather, for uh, the beginning of next weekend.